Hey there folks, this is GreenyXI welcoming you right back to Let's Play Lunger, this is episode 20. In the last episode we went to the Fire Manor, got the Fire Wand, and the Water Book, <laughs> and Life Vessel, and the Gilded Falcon, and an extra Magic Seed. We did quite a bit of it last time actually, didn't we? But now we're going to do another bit of optional stuff before going for the Stone Giant. I know, I know, we're putting it off quite a bit, but you'll be thankful for this because this is something we we'll have to do as well eventually. So we're just getting there a bit earlier really. Uh, Magiscar, we want to head towards there. This actually ain't bad as a weapon, I've never used it, I've always thought, I've always preferred to use the sword. But this ain't bad, I quite like it. Right, remember up here, there was this block before going into Magiscar. Or after, Wh whichever, you know what I mean. Taller Mountain, we're not actually going there into Taller Mountain yet. That's for later, for sure. I think it's quite far off yet. But, it's worth coming to this area now. Because we got the fire wand, we can head into here. And make our way to the Ice Manor. This is one of the toughest locations in the games, in terms of puzzles. If you didn't like Klein Stream, then it's a very good chance you won't like this either. Uh, no, don't fall down. I know that's not right. There's a maze. Bloody maze. It's down here somewhere. Huh. There we go. So awkward. <laughs> Let's get the chest just first, considering we saw it. Ah, oh, it's one of them. Never mind, I don't want it. Okay. The ice manor, here it is. It doesn't look icy from the outside, but get ready for the inside. The puzzles are solid. Absolutely rock solid. You need to do ice pillar puzzles all the way through. And uh, for this puzzle specifically, you need to end up by ya. Uh, and all the others, there's a switch under each of those. Um, we need to get two in these sorts of places. This was pushed up. I don't know the solution, by the way. I really don't. Um. Um. If we push this across, this one, you'll go by here. Then we'd have to push this one across. But then it would go off this switch. I don't think we can push this off here. So I'm going to try something. I'm not sure how we'd get the right switch if I do it this way. We'll find out as we go along, I guess. That will do that. But. Oh, I think we've lost it. If I did push this one across this way now. If I did push this one across this way. This one across. That would go in there. But then how would we get one on there? We couldn't. I think I've mucked up. From the get-go. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> let's try that again, shall we? Okay, let's try it again then. It's about my millionth try now, but... You know. <sighs> uh, I don't like it. Oh, we've got... Whoa. Thank God for... Look, we've done it. You can actually destroy him with the ball and chain if you really wanted to. I'm not that first. Puzzle number two. Entirely trial and error. To go through the middle door, you need to open up the gates in the... From the left and the right. Okay, we'll try that one first. Left. What I tend to do is... Put one direction and then just keep on going around like this. 
So then, we go back to the left. Right. Over to the right. <laughs> there we go. The easiest puzzle of the three, for sure. Puzzle number three. Ice puzzle. Ice pillar again. You need to make a bridge so that you can get across to the chest chest that's our ultimate reward for this place. But how? You can use these statue heads as well. You need to know your distance jumping for this. I say you can use the statue heads, can't you? No. Oh, well. Remember that wrong. <laughs> okay, we'll give it a try or two. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. But don't destroy them with your bone chain. It's not going to work, probably. If I push this left, it would just go all the way. So that's not going to work. You need to get on you. Then speed up a little bit. Do you reckon if I push it up, it'll be close enough to... No. <laughs> no, it won't. Okay. Oh, I know. No, I didn't. I didn't know. Bollocks. <sighs> Start again. Bloody hell. Why am I so bad at these things? Oh, okay. Let's try this instead. Try from a different. Can't reach. Mm. Um, 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 um. They're too close together. We need to be able to jump in between, you know? If we had another one, we probably could have done it, maybe. Now we could. Huh. No. Bloody hell. I'll try one more time. Okay, so if I push it. <laughs> Need to push this one up first, do we? Would it be... No. <clears throat> one more time. <laughs> If I'm doing the same things wrong every time and I'm noticing, <laughs> which I probably am. <sighs> Hate this puzzle so much. So I'm not talking, I'm just, you know, concentrating. It happens now and again, I do concentrate now and again. Sometimes. Oh, I needed to do that. Okay, I might be okay. If we could go on their heads, it would be so much easier. We just can't. Hmm, wait. I don't know if we can go far enough at the end part. 
Yeah, we Oh my god! <laughs> that shocked even me. Ice wand obtained! Yeah! So we've got the fire wand and the ice wand. <laughs> this will be important for mainly a certain dungeon later on, but also other parts. Fun strangely, even though you get the fire wand before the ice wand, even though you have to get the fire wand before the ice wand, the ice wand looks appears in the menu before the ice before the fire wand. It's strange. But yeah. Pretty much the same sort of deal as with the fire wand with damage and stuff like that. And that's about all we got time for. Bloody hell. Do you know what? We'll do one more thing. I want to go on over to the Desert of Despair. Now that we've finally done the Ice Manor. I've been dreading it a little bit, so I'm quite glad that that's done. Yeah, like I said, like I was saying. I want to go over to the Ice Manor. Uh, <laughs> not the Ice Manor at all. The desert. Oop, that's what it says. Yeah, Desert Despair. Desert Despair, that's the one. Not Desert of Despair. No. <laughs> just, just play it. I normally get this later in the game, but we can get it now, I guess. Back at the water wheel and stuff, look. It's pretty good. Yeah, 31 life vessels. We could have 32 if we really wanted to. I mean, we might as well do this really quick, can't we? It's something that... It'll be the last time we go to the desert now. We've gone back through a couple of times. And yeah. Last time. Remember... <clears throat> when we got the sluice key, we had to sort of leave behind something because there were fire pillars in front of it. That's what we're doing now. I'm sure we missed the Gilded Falcon around here somewhere. But I'm not too bothered. We're not this ain't a hundred percent run or anything, so Oop. And you don't have to worry too much about the all anyway. Yay! Made it all the way without falling. Who saw that coming? Oi! It's not... <laughs> it's not going in. Okay, we have to do the jump again. Something that seems so simple. But bloody isn't. <laughs> Come on, Landry, you can do it. Get the spring beans out. Why can't he carry a plant pot around everywhere? Oh, there we go. Did it pretty quick, actually. Here we go. If you want to get rid of fire pillars, you have to first freeze them. And then get the iron flail out. And smash them. Another life vessel, so we've got 32 health. And that's all I want to do today, so... <laughs> um, yeah, this has been Greeny XI. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again in a bit when we go for... We're actually going to carry on with the game. For the stuff we actually have to do right now. So we'll be going for the Stone Giant next time, which is something very big. One of the most grand sort of adventures we've had so far, if, if there is one. <laughs> so, see you in a bit, folks.